Marcus Conti reporting breaking news, breaking news. Jeffrey Epstein remanded back to jail. <laughs> Jeffrey Epstein, judge denies Jeffrey Epstein bail. Go back to jail, mother effer. Judge denied. Multiple uh, multiple uh, outlets are reporting. You got CNBC reporting, uh, Washington Post, I saw, Wall Street Journal. Confirmed. I'm not at the courthouse right now, but this is pretty confirmed. There'll be more as the day goes on. Judge denies Jeffrey Epstein bail in child sex trafficking case, citing flight risk and potential danger to the public. <laughs> now it's starting to get real. Now it's real. Now we have a real case. He's going to plea bargain, but we have a real case. So let's look at the facts. A judge denied uh, bail to wealthy investor Jeffrey Epstein, who has been locked up since his arrest nearly two weeks ago on child trafficking charges. Epstein will not will not remain in jail. Epstein will not remain in jail pending his trial. What? A federal judge denied uh, Epstein will not remain in jail pending his trial. That doesn't make sense. That doesn't make sense. Uh, a federal judge on Thursday denied bail to wealthy investor Jeffrey Epstein, who, that's a typo, has been locked up since his arrest nearly two weeks ago. The decision in U.S. District Court Manhattan means that the 66-year-old Epstein will remain in jail pending trial in the case, All right. where he faces uh, up to 45 years in prison if convicted. Judge Richard Berman said the risk that Epstein will flee to avoid trial as well as the potential danger he poses to the public if released, warrants keeping him behind bars. Breaking story. What else do we know? Let's just make sure we got it right. Judge denies Jeffrey Epstein bail request. Financer will remain in jail while awaiting his trial on sex trafficking charges. Uh, so he's been there since the 6th. Okay, it's a done deal, right? We'll find out more. Uh, he tried everything in his... He tried everything in his power to uh, to get out. He had his lawyers. They wanted to put up the house, the $77 million mansion in, in Manhattan. Judge said no. They wanted to, you know, arm guards outside. Judge said no. I, so this is good news, man. It's a breaking story. We'll, we'll, we'll keep on it. And um, I don't know. I, like I said, I, this is where it starts to get real because now he is, now you've got some bargaining power. Now you've got a guy who's going to sing like a bird. If he want, he wants to get out of this for five years or less or, or between five and 10 years sentence, he's going to sing like a bird, right? He's going to, he's going to tell us the exact nature of his scheme. Is it a, is it a, a blackmail scheme where they blackmail, where he blackmails billionaires by, you know, luring them into his Island and getting them to have sex with underage women or opening the door for that possibility to happen? We're going to find out all of this stuff. And because he's remanded back to jail, uh, it's it's really good. I mean, it's again, if he's sitting in his mansion in Manhattan, you know, eating caviar and fucking, you know, and smoking the hookah and, and he's got the hooker in the other room, and it, then, then it's like he wants a prolonged trial. But now what you want to do is you want to, you know, if the judge says, okay, uh, trial set for next year, guy's going to shit in his pants. Right? Is you got a Caesar Sayoc on your hand. He's gonna shit in his pants. He's gonna sit there and he's gonna and he's gonna think about taking a plea and, and confessing to 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 his um, his horrible crime. So uh Marcus Conti reporting, very, very good news, very good news on uh on Jeffrey Epstein. Uh back to jail, back to jail for Jeffrey Epstein. Marcus Conti reporting.